We are at the Village on Main Street in Frisco. This is a Normandy Homes build. And I just wanted to point out the, some of the features of this home, what I like about it, and what maybe could use some improvement. So when you walk in here, you are greeted with this double high ceiling living room. You've got the dramatic windows on the second story there. And you've got the overlooking balcony from the game room upstairs. I love the big, open, dramatic feel right off the foyer you have the office and as you can see it's large enough for this double desk that they put in there specifically to show how large it is which is great it's not a cramped office at all you've got a patio area right off the eating kitchen area and as you can see it's these are smaller lots because at this price point in Frisco that's what you're gonna get but as you can see they turfed it this has become a lot more common lately to see especially with smaller lots to see the it turfed instead of having you know strips of grass I like it I like the look of it I like the sustainability of it and everything like that I'm interested to see how y'all feel about it the kitchen here you've got the uh, countertop on this uh, quartz island uh, excuse me the sink on the quartz island you've got uh, it's not a double oven that is a uh, microwave with the oven underneath lots of cabinetry uh, and a walk-in pantry which you know who doesn't need as much storage as possible right you've got the shared bath laundry and then the mudroom rack and this has be really become a feature a staple of literally all new homes over say 2,500 square feet the mudroom rack is a must lately back here we've got the primary suite which again for this size home it's a good size primary suite you've got the walk-in well one walk-in closet there and then as we come back through the bathroom we actually have another walk-in closet back here this one is a good bit larger so plenty of storage in the kitchen plenty of closet space in the bedroom and in lieu of a freestanding tub, which more builders are getting away from, you have this huge walk-in shower with no door. So it's not ever gonna be a steam shower because it's not enclosed, but it gives you that uh, bright, large, uh, airy feel to it. I'm, I'm also interested in your feedback on such a large shower. Let's go upstairs and see what we have. So as you can see upstairs, from the stairs on up, everything up here is carpet. We have those beautiful engineered hardwoods downstairs, but up here it's all carpet. And this is obviously a budget saving feature. And you know, that's something that based on your price point, especially in such a high desire and uh, high price point area of Frisco, this is something that you may have to compromise on. I mean, it's a good quality carpet. It's just carpet, right? They do have lots of windows in pretty much every room. So plenty of natural light, which was a great choice by the builder. Secondary bedrooms are a good size. They all have walk-in closets. They all have either an ensuite bathroom or a bathroom very close by. Similar finishes to the downstairs bathroom and kitchen. Here's the media room, and we've been seeing this more commonly lately. It's not your standard rear entry dramatic media room. We're seeing more intimately sized media rooms where the idea is not to turn all the lights off and watch a movie and privacy and quiet. It's more of this is in the center of the house where family can, you know, play pool, play a board game out there and these doors will be open. They can watch TV in here. So it's a, a we're seeing a little transition into how builders are treating the media room. So what are your thoughts on, on this? A, a less traditionally styled media room. Back here, we've got two more bedrooms with the shared bath, pretty conventional like I said the, the bedrooms are a good size for uh, a house this size but uh, you know nothing fancy uh, walk-in closets is a must these days so even the second or even your smallest bedroom uh, in, in anything over say 2700 feet is gonna have a walk-in closet so this is something that buyers are definitely asking for um, so we've got lots of storage in the kitchen we've got turf grass we've got a, a, a transition style media room uh, walk-in closets and all the, the bedrooms all the secondary bedrooms so I'd love to hear your feedback on hey, 
what do you think about these features? Are these things that you're looking for in your home? And is there anything here that you would change? 